somebody feels like you're just right for them. Marriage. This relationship is moving towards a sacred union. After some time apart. Maybe we'll hold the spirit. Release. Interference. Oh, wow. New love. Deny your integrity. Maybe you um detaching your energy from somebody after seeing clearly through a situation. Um definitely maintaining your integrity. You could feel like a situation just not online with your values and morals. I think I got something like this in my last reading. Hmm. Yeah, something about the red flags was cautioning you about this person. Maybe you found out this person is married. Okay. That rejection is actually divine protection. Intuition. Okay, so you can be allowing your intuition to guide you at this time. Spirit is saying new love is here for you. Let's see what's going on. <clears throat> well, this could be somebody who's married, releasing, you know, deciding to get a divorce. Let's see what's going on. <clears throat> but there's definitely a third party here, okay? Give me some. I'm going to pull for the divinely guided messages of love. Spirit, give me some messages on this current situation. I'm hearing somebody's going to be blown away. <clears throat> so first card out, we have disagreement. I wish you understood how I feel. So this person um, wants you to understand how they um, they feeling at this time. Chaser. Mm. It's like the, whoever this person is that wants to chase you. Um, they feel like you're making it hard because I, whatever they're saying to you, there's some type of disagreement um, or indifference between you guys where it's like, I feel like some seeds, you could be not wanting to hear this person out and this person is saying or feeling like it's hard to chase you because whatever they're saying or, or whatever how they feel, they want you to understand what they're going through. I heard um, a minute ago, Somebody gonna be blown away. Okay. Give me more of this energy, Holy Spirit. Thank you. Destiny. I'm struggling to find to find the right path. So this person doesn't know you know where they're going in life. They're not on the right path. This is somebody who's like could be looking back. It's giving me like the seven of pentacles. Looking back at their life, you know, what they, they invested, what they what they gave their time, the energy to. And somebody's not happy about it. Yeah, sabotage. I messed up the good things in life. I'm sorry. I mess up the good things in my life sometimes. So whoever this person is, this is somebody who has a habit of sabotaging and, and messing up good things that comes into their life. Yeah. And somebody is it's like somebody want want you to get, you know, get how they feel, get what they're going through. But I, I, I don't see how you're going to... Not with no damn third-party interference. <laughs> I mean, what they want you to get. Give me a card on the chase, the Holy Spirit. Thank you. Mm. My nose itching. Give me one second. I feel like um, this person wasn't giving you equal give and take. Give me another call. It's been a year. It was, you felt like it was nothing but confusion. You was unclear about where you and this person stand. Give me another call, Holy Spirit. Yeah. There's somebody who held back um, expressing how they feel. You could be now holding back your energy. Give me another card, Holy Spirit. Hold it back. Yeah, I cannot make it up. It's not, look, third, third party. There, there were other things that got in the way of us being together. Now, this third party could be people, places, and things. But with marriage coming out first, it was somebody. Somebody's mad. There's another person in the picture. Okay, it says there were other things that got in the way of us being together. Yeah, so if you was wondering why this person uh, was holding back from you, not expressing their feelings, if you felt like this person was confusing you, this person was just unclear, you didn't know where, where you guys stand because this person was dealing with someone else. 
Okay, this is someone who constantly messes up good things that come into their life. They sabotage it. This is someone who's unclear of their destiny. They don't know where they're going in life. Um, they struggling, to, to, you know, to stay on, um, stay on one path. Okay, whatever path they on, it ain't the right path. Okay, that's why spirit is saying um, with the new love and deny you. Um, maybe you, maybe at one point you was in deny you. Um, because you was confused, but I feel like some type of truth and clarity came through that was able to set you free. Yeah. And when you found out about it, you was like, with integrity, this situation just don't align with your values and morals. I feel like who I'm picking up on, you love yourself enough to know when it's time to let this, let something go. Warning, don't dismiss the red flags. Rejection, this rejection is actually divine protection. I feel like all you want to do is just be happy, okay? You want your own love, okay? Not somebody else's man or somebody else's woman. You letting your intuition guide you. There's somebody who messes up every good thing that come in their life, okay? There's somebody who's not on the right path at all. What's this? I mess up the good things in life, Holy Spirit. Understanding. I see, I see your side of the story. So somebody do understand why you either walked away or you're holding back or you're deciding to move on to new love. Somebody do understand that. Now they do have enough sense to understand, like, you know. <laughs> Yeah, I feel like somebody... I, that car fell over there or something. If somebody was trying to make you feel low or trying to degrade you in any type of way, it was because... I don't know. I'm picking up on an energy where somebody will be mean and, and hold back their feelings and their emotions and make somebody confused or be real cold and nasty to you, but that was all to distract you from what they really had going on. Somebody didn't want you to know that it was a third party in the picture. I feel like you have to let this person know who who you really are, and you had then you and you standing on that. And I feel like you, for whoever I'm picking up on, I don't even think you said anything. You just left. You just pulled your energy back. What's this understanding? I see this. I see your side of the story. Yeah, damage. Mm -hmm. Whoever this person is, they're damaged. Somebody also know by... Mm, well, it says damage. We are both, both hurting from this. Whoever you are, it was hurting you to stay with in this connection. And it's hurting this person to see you go. What if I'm picking up on? I feel like you're getting high, getting closer to like something that's 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 beautiful for you. Mm. You had to do what was best for you because that then this third party don't align with your values and morals. I'm talking to my empress and my empress. I know. Yeah, daydreaming. I'm always longing for you. This person is always daydreaming about you and longing for you. Forgiveness. I'm struggling to get over the past. This person is struggling to get over you. They wish for your forgiveness. There's somebody who don't know where they're going in life. And whoever they're dealing with, they got to put up with that. Not you. Not you. Not you. Okay? Damn. It says missed opportunity. I didn't act when I should have. Something could have been three weeks ago, three days ago, three months ago. Conversation, I want to call you. I want to hear your voice. Broken. I feel shattered about this situation. This person wants to reach out to you. They want to talk to you. Yeah, this person is shattered. But they know um, by, you, by you staying in this connection with them, you know, they know that it was hurting you. They knew it. They just couldn't keep it honest with you. For others of you guys, it just hurt this person because they don't longer have access to you. I feel like your respect is more important than anything. Your integrity is more important than anything. 
and somebody knew that if, if if you received the clarity, if you if you got the truth, you was out of there. I feel like somebody is used to like Jezebel spirits, people that's confused, people that are that don't know where they're going in life. Somebody hope and wish for someone like you, but they in a situation where. Uh, I mean, they caught up in the situation, so I see. Yeah, unexpected outcome. Things didn't go the way I planned. It sure didn't. It sure didn't because you decided to be single. Pull your energy back. Dishonesty. By, li by lying, I ripped us apart. Yeah. But some of you guys, you would have just respected this person just would have kept it 100 with you. Like, listen, I got a wife or I got a husband. Okay? Now, you choose to do with that whatever you choose to do with that. Okay, and we're gonna pick it up on my divine beings. You would have been like head to the no, to the no, to the no. Some of you guys, you probably wouldn't have been mad at that person for just keeping it real with you. Maybe you guys would have decided just just to be this person's friend, keep it on a friend, you know, a friendship level. Sometimes you you know you find people where you know you guys are good at just being friends, but you know you you know you can't date this person because this person is not like. How can I see it? So this could have been somebody who was your friend first and then you got in a relationship with them. Because some people you realize that, like, damn, you was a better friend than, to me than, than, you know, you were in a relationship. Mm. This person never, this person never felt a passion this intense. Soul contract. The lessons I learned from us will never be forgotten. This person will never be able to forget you. Yeah, reminiscing. I miss our inside jokes, regret. I wish this never happened. This person is drowning in sorrow. This is somebody who's in a whole nother connection. Don't want to be there. I can't even fumble just being with somebody and they going through it. Reminiscing and regret. Wishing that they was with a whole nother person. Who child. Hope I haven't given up on us yet. Somebody feels like you satisfy the every need. Somebody sees you as the truth. Guilty. I feel pain from the damage I've caused. Somebody mad as hell because they see you as the real deal. Time. I'm afraid it's too late to take action. <clears throat> Somebody is afraid that it's too late to take action. I feel like something that happened between you and this person, it happened naturally. Naturally. Nothing was forced. The, the chemistry was the bomb dot calm from the jump. But they lied. They didn't tell you what they had going on. Yeah. Mistakes. I wish I could right my wrongs. Damn, unworthy. You are a better person than I am. Somebody sees you as the truth. Some of you guys feel like the stress from dealing with this person was just too draining. It's like when this person used to get around you or get around in your energy, this somebody that was just hoping and praying like this could last forever, like you have this person, when they're around you, they feel like they're on a vacation. I'm telling you. <laughs> yeah. They do not want to give up on... Look, they don't want to give up on this empress. I told you, I knew it was my the, divine beings. Empress to the king of swords. They was cold, they was detached. <laughs> Give me more this energy on this part. Two of Pentacles. Juggling, going back and forth. When they should have just been real with you from the job. Give me more of this part. Ten of Pentacles. Eight of Wands. So you could have received some type of communication about some type of family, a marriage, King of Swords. Maybe when you met this person, maybe they maybe they was on, in separation. Okay, um, maybe they weren't on good terms when you met this person. Yeah, and this person met you, nine of cups, page of swords. 
they seen you, they, and you just was like, you was they everything. You was they wish fulfillment to the temperance. You was very balanced. They loved your energy, the star card. You was shiny, baby. You still shining, though, sun seeds. <laughs> yeah. Look, the queen of swords to the king of swords. So whoever, whoever they in a marriage with, they're not even getting along. You could have definitely met this person when they was in some type of breakup or separation. Yeah, but with the Eight of Wands, Ten of Pentacles, maybe you've seen something online or um, somebody communicated to you and this person was juggling you or this person had a family somewhere else or this person had a family. Maybe you found out like, oh, what the heck? Like this person, somebody, somebody communicated or somebody said something about somebody having a family. Sure did. Four of Pentacles, the Devil card. Oh, child. The higher friend. Whoever this, this this person is, um, Capricorn, the higher friend, Taurus energy, whoever this person is, Sagittarius energy, <sighs> this person toxic that they want to hold on to you that's already married. Give me my Holy Spirit. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Holy Spirit. The hangman. Hey yeah, somebody, somebody is stuck in a family dynamic. I'm telling you, in a family situation. Mm -hmm. The hangman, Pisces energy. The hangman. Thank you. Page of cups. This person could be wanting to apologize because they had so much regret. Um, they felt like they made a mistake. They felt like they made a, a, a mistake. They felt like they ruined things with you guys. And they feel like, you know, by them lying to you, it ripped this connection apart with the Ten of Wands being here. It's like somebody don't want to be a player. They feel drained. They feel like they caused you so much damage. This person, this person is having a hard time and struggling. Thank you, Spirit. This person's having a hard time and struggling um, with what they did to you. I, you may not think it, but they are. Somebody don't want to be a player. They really don't. Because they found, they found, they found you. They know they want you. What's the page of cups, Holy Spirit? Yeah, the high priestess. Damn. Double Pisces. Something could be happening this season right now. Happy birthday to my Pisces. Um. Oh. <sighs> This person just got too many damn secrets. What's the high priestess? Five of cups, four of swords. They regret, they regret holding back from you. They regret these secrets, four of swords. What's the four of swords? Somebody feel like they broke your heart. Four sports, eight of pentacles. They really want to work on things. They really do want to heal things with you. But somebody feel like, I just heard you're the only one for me. But with the five of cups, I feel like this person is like in despair. This person is focused on, you know, you know, this loss of losing you. It could definitely be a lot of uh, remorse, sadness, grief. They could be feeling abandoned by you. What's the four swords, eight of pentacles? So this could just be, this could be, this person could be trying to heal four pentacles to the eight of pentacles. I mean, I'm sorry, four swords to the eight of pentacles. What's up, the eight of pentacles? Thank you, spirit. The fool card.
the magician. Somebody could feel like a damn fool for not healing things with you or working on things with you. The magician to aid us towards, yeah. Somebody, um, this person regrets not taking action sooner because they were trying to manipulate the situation to keep you stuck. Queen of Swords for the magician. It's like you see right through it. Can I have a card on the food? Yeah, I can't make it that up. Ace of Swords, Spirit said that's the truth. I feel like you received some type of truth and clarity. It was like, it was all you needed to free yourself. And with this food card, this woman have like an amethyst in her hand. Something about your intuition. It told you that this hell no, son ain't right with this person. You received some type of truth, and it was like it was a breakthrough for you. For a lot of you guys, you could be just focused on your healing at this time. The sun card, the moon card, something got illuminated. Leo, Cancer, Pisces, energy. Page of Wands. You you received some type of message about this person. What's the eight of wands, Holy Spirit? Thank you. Ten of Cups. About a family at a distance. What's the Ten of Cups? The Death card wanted to come out. It caused the ending. The Chariot in reverse. Yeah, something wasn't moving. See, cancer Energy. Yeah, something was no longer going to move forward. Yeah, because you found out about a family. 10-10, ten, ten, a cycle was closed out. Six of four, this is you moving away to calm waters. Queen of Wands, the World Card. Somebody could have been trying to, like... Yeah, somebody could have been wanting to have somebody as a mistress. You know, somebody on the side. And, and, and he was like, hell no. But somebody feel like you made for them. <laughs> this person is just not ready. What's the what's the chariot? This person is too damn confused. Knight of Pentacles. This person needs to do some work, and that's why the spirit is like hell. No, this is not gonna move nowhere. This is not gonna go off the ground because this person needs to work on themselves. They need to heal themselves. They need to put in the hard work. Yeah, three of swords. Somebody is hurt. Yeah, nine of pentacles. They hurt, but they hurt that they lost you. Somebody is. Somebody tried to deny this connection. Like, <clears throat> excuse me. They tried to deny this con connection. Somebody realized ain't nobody do it like you do it, baby. Damn. Page of Pentacles and it came out sideways. It's like something couldn't even get off the ground. Look how she got one foot on the ground and the other foot up. But it came out sideways. It's like something couldn't even get off the ground. Yeah, Knight of Cups. You guys could have just been in the beginning stages. Something did not even get off the ground. Because your intuition, your intuition told you that there were some secrets or this person was hiding something with the moon card. What's this page of Pentacles sideways? Something did not get off the ground. Yeah, judgment. Five of Wands. You just knew this person was lying. You caught judgment. What's the Ten of Pentacles? Page of Wands. This could be like a younger fire sign. Ace of Pentacles, King of Swords, King of Pentacles. It's like whoever this person is that wants to reconcile with you and bring you off of this person got a whole goddamn family though. What's the page of wands? What's the page of wands? The devil, Capricorn energy. Maybe they could be married to a fire sign or married to a Capricorn. 
Okay. Queen of Pentacles could definitely be an Earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Definitely have you on a Capricorn. The Moon card, they're hiding this. Cancer Pisces energy, they are hiding that they're married to an Earth sign or a younger Fire sign. Or this person could just be younger in age. Five of Wands. This person could have put you in competition with this person. What's the Five of Wands, Holy Spirit? Five of Wands clean five with a magician? Mm. What's the magician? Uh-uh. Heavy on the manipulation. This is this is nothing but addictions over here. Somebody could be keeping somebody because of finances. They know maybe somebody uh maybe somebody take care of this person. Yeah, maybe they get this person money. Empress. Four wands. This could be your twin flame, the tower. Empress, the four wands of the tower. Um, Taurus, Libra energy, and Scorpio energy. Yeah, Queen of Wands, Four Cups, yeah, Knight of Cups. Whoever this person is, um, they feel rejected by you. Yeah, you left this person because you was just unhappy. Twin Flame or not. What's the Five of Wands energy? It's like somebody is, is, is doing some type of mad, some manipulation. Um... This, whoever this person is, they could be taking care of them. Seven of Pentacles. Seven of Cups. Yeah, don't just give me, don't just miss that red flags. Well, I feel like both of these people playing each other. So if this person is married to this person and they tried to play, play you with them, they getting played too. Whoever this person is, they playing them too. What's the Seven of Pentacles? What the hell is going here? The Wheel of Fortune. Ooh, child. Five of Pentacles. What's the Wheel of Fortune? Six of Cups. Something is, is, is fated to change when it comes to the past. I feel like something is going to explode and blow up because this is destiny. Somebody from your somebody has to somebody not on the right somebody from your past is not on the right path. Spirit is about to expose something with this tower. I'm telling you, this person gonna find out whoever they married to. This person is cheating on them. I'm telling you, okay. You might be finding out it, they might be releasing this person whoever this third, whoever this, they put you in a third party with whatever. They gonna find out they they getting cheated on. Yeah, the sun card. <laughs> Something gonna get eliminated to them. Ooh, chill. Ooh, chill. Because this person is not on a right path. They are not supposed to be with this person. What's the Sister Cup? Sister Cup is clarified with the Four Pentacles. The Lovers. Three of Wands. Somebody trying to hold on to somebody. And they don't want somebody to move on. Yeah, Seven of Wands. They blocking this person. That's why Spirit is about to bring a tower in. I'm telling you. Spirit going to bring a tower in to break this up. Yeah. Ace of Cups. But I feel like Spirit is moving you out the way. Because you've been doing the work on yourself. Okay? Ace of Cups. New Love. That's why Spirit is saying that rejection is actually um, divine protection. Because this person needs to do the healing. Just because something is about to break up between these two people. Ooh, confirmation. That was a loud bird. <laughs> oh, excuse me. Um, just because something is about to break up with this, whatever they got going. Because this person is not supposed to be over here. Spirit is, is not like, oh. Spirit is going to bring you guys, you know, right together right away. No. Spirit is saying with the four pinnacles to the eight of pinnacles, this person must still do the healing work. 
they still they gotta they gotta work on themselves they gotta heal but something gonna get broken up because this person is not supposed to be with this person and i feel like in the meantime between time spirit is you're gonna have new love okay yes i can't make it up stepping the swords under the bottom yes stepping the swords ace of wands listen somebody whoever they is married to oh child i'm telling you they they out <laughs> Somebody out messing around on them. They they cheating on them. Ace of Wands to the Seven of Swords. They getting cheated on. Damn. Look how the look how the cookies crumble. Oh child. This person is getting played. But that's their karma. Give me a card on the seven of swords. That's their karma. Ooh, two of swords in reverse. Somebody about to see clearly now. Two of swords in reverse. What's this two of swords in reverse? They about to see what's up. Spirit said, I'm about to show you something. Knight of Wands and the Sun card. I'm telling you, somebody could be dating a younger fire your star. Or somebody could just be. I feel like the passion between you and this person, the chemistry between you and this person, I feel like it took off right away. It was very intense as hell. He had a death card and two of cards. I'm telling you, something is about to happen that's about to bring a major change. The death card, the two of cups. Queen of cups. Five of swords. This could be a jealous. I'm telling you, whoever whoever they in a connection with, they don't want to let them go. Mm-hmm. They don't want to let them go, but somebody don't want to be there. But spirit, really like, all right, don't 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 don't, don't worry about it. I'm so, I'm gonna do something that's gonna force your behind to get the hell up on out of there. The seven of swords to the ace of wands. Where till they find out this person who they who they was married to or who they was messing with is cheating on them. It's going to break the whole connection up. I'm telling you. The world card. King of Swords. King of Pentacles. I'm telling you, they about to, whoever this person is that's married to this person, they about to find out the truth. Hmm. And after this betrayal, which is the Ten of Swords, then they're going to come and take action towards you. King of Wands to the Ten of Swords. The higher friend to the Nine of Swords. Because they could even be having dreams and visions that this person is already cheating. Damn. Give me a card on the Ten of Swords, Holy Spirit. The Ten of Swords. Thank you. Ten of Swords is clarified with the Nine of Cups and Two of Wands. Somebody can feel betrayed or feel hurt um, by not making a decision or a choice to go towards the person who they want to give this offer to. Somebody felt like they took too long when it, when it came to taking action towards this connection. Eight of Cups. This person felt like you got away. What's the Nine of Cups energy? Thank you, Spirit. Seven of Cups. The Nine of Cups. It's like this person spent a lot of time in their head confused. Um, nine of Cups. This could, this could be somebody who's who's um, who has some type of addiction. Maybe they drinking a lot. They in these feelings. What's the three of pentacles to the justice? The three of swords is here. I feel like whoever this karmic is, this third party is, that they ain't got no, they what they didn't have no business being with, that they lied to you about, okay? Here the hermit, I feel like this person is being investigated. When they find out this person cheated on them, it's gonna be like, how you say it? Um, murder she wrote. I think I'm saying it right. But it, it's going to break this connection up. And that's going to be somebody's karma. The spirit was telling this person. Wanted somebody to release. Let go. The hermit. The shrimp. The page of swords. Yeah. Somebody is studying something. Watching something. Okay. Leo. Virgo. Energy. Six of one. This person watching you. Stand, um, stand in your power. Somebody is watching you get a victory, success. It's like this person, but, but you, whoever you are, they never stop watching you. Five of Pentacles, eight, eight of Cups. Okay? 
when this person walked away from you or you walked away from this person, <clears throat> take it how it resonates, you walked away or they walked away from you, and somebody never stopped watching you. Queen of Cups, nine of, nine of Cups. It's like this person don't want to give up on this connection. But they also didn't want to give up a third party that Spirit was saying. It says marriage, interference, and release. Spirit was telling somebody to let somebody go. Let somebody go. <clears throat> Constantly daydreaming about this person. You want to be with this person. You're all in your head with the eight of swords. Okay. Yeah. The higher friend to the five of swords. Somebody didn't want to let a relationship or I mean a marriage go. Temperance to the star. But this they want this they want this they want this balanced energy. Temperance to the star. It's like this is chosen. This is chosen, baby. And they stress all the time. Nine of swords, king of cups. Can't even sleep at night. Sleep this night. Stressing. Possibly laying next to somebody. The spirit ain't even spirit said that's not your person. Queen of swords, that's the truth. I'm telling you, spirit is about to come through. And when they find out, listen to me. When they find out that the person who it seems so hard to let go. Because it could have been somebody was doing some magic with this damn magician. Whoever this earth sign is. Um, or, they, or you could be the earth sign, but with the but with the queen of pentacles to the devil, who chair? Or you could be a Capricorn. This could have been being done with you, the queen of pentacles, the magician to the devil, the magician to the devil, baby. Hell to the new, hell to the new. What did I say there? I must have put it back in. I must have put it back in. Now, I know damn well we just need that magician for it. <clears throat> oh, here we go. Yeah. The the magician to the, the devil, that's, that's magic. That's black magic. Somebody was doing it to keep somebody stuck. And Spirit been warning them, like, listen. Confirmation, Spirit been warning them, like, get your behind up out of that. Okay? Because somebody's doing spell work on you. And then on top of that, they cheat and they playing you. And the one you reminiscing about, the one you want to truly be with, the one you want to heal things with, you over here letting this person get away. So Spirit, like, you know what I'm going to come through? I'm going I'm, I'm to break it all up. And this person still got to go within the heal. Because it might be something that, you know, can be very devastating. <clears throat> but Spirit is saying that rejection was for your protection. Okay. Well, I hope this reading resonates on seeds. I hope it helps you guys, give you guys clarity on your situation. Okay, anything you need to know about me, my son seeds, will be in the description box. Later, son seeds. Let me see if I can pull you one or two cards from this deck. Anything else, Holy Spirit? Yeah, better off as friends. Maybe yes or no. Warning. So maybe you felt like you and this person was better off as friends. Or that's how y'all are right now. Y'all better off as friends right now. Um, let go of those people and things and things that don't appreciate or empower you. Give yourself permission to be happy. And I feel like that's what you guys are doing. Again, it says let go of those people and things that don't appreciate or empower you. Give yourself permission to be happy. 111, trust your intuition. Divine feminine. Very um very mystical a very mystical being. Um uh, emotionally, mentally, physically, um, you are more advanced. Okay. Um uh, 50 dimension, a chosen ascension, 888, 8888, abundance, big blessings, transform in frequency. You could be saying 8888 or 888, but spirit is saying big blessings, big abundance. That rejection was for your protection. You could be an Egyptian goddess. Okay, and this person is saying, I'm sorry I lied to you. You got that old school authentic, you got that old school authentic wisdom at its finest. <laughs>